Hey, question of the day today. What happens if you have kids and they don't want to go with their father? This is a thing, so I'm going to answer this question in the best way I can, and it's tough. It's a tough one. So a lot of the time, kids don't want to go. And if they don't want to go, unless there's some really strong reason, like there's abuse going on, if they don't want to go, that's not a reason for them not to go. Kids don't want to do a lot of things. So the court doesn't want to hear from you, oh, the kids don't want to go, um, so I didn't make them go. Bottom line is, if there is a schedule, it's your job, at least in most states, to try and uphold it. So you need to make good faith efforts to make sure the kids go on visitation and don't make it their choice. And this is what you're doing. This is your time with your mom. This is your time with your dad. You're going to go. So you really risk being held in contempt if you end up in a situation where you are just like, ah, kids didn't want to go, so I didn't make them go. That's not a reason. If there's something going on over there, then you have an obligation to try and bring an action or to try to do something if you really feel like your kids are in uh, danger. That's different though. I want to let you know that's different than if you think there's something going on and it's dangerous. Well, then don't send your kids. But this is just the kids don't want to go. If they don't want to go, unfortunately, that's not their choice. I hope that helps. Take care.